all the you know the the verbal etiquette, the mannerisms in Japan, which is a lot compared to different countries. Um, I had no idea what they were. You know, I didn't know I shouldn't drink before the elder. Before you know, we sit down and we're with some company president, and we get our drinks, or he doesn't get his drink yet, and I'm like just sipping mine already. I didn't know I didn't I couldn't do that. Um, you know, before you eat itadakimasu, after you eat kotsuhama, you know, I, I didn't know those words. Um, the the problem with that was me looking Japanese. I was expected to know all that. I mean, if I had blue eyes, blonde hair, and I didn't do that, they'd be like, ah, this foreign, this this guy Jin doesn't know the 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 mannerisms here. But because I look so Japanese, I was portrayed as like a rude Japanese in a way. For the people who didn't know who I was, you see a restaurant with a president that that really doesn't know me that much, and I'm sitting with the president of the English school, just coming with him. So I'm not really introduced like that. And I'm there just sitting down drinking my juice and he doesn't even has his. It's not a good impression. So I had a lot of problems with that. Everyone thinking that I know the language. Everyone thinking that I should speak. I got stopped once on the road with the police. And he asked me for my license in Japanese, which I didn't understand at the time because I just came here. And I, you know, I looked at him and said, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm giving him the registration, which usually people ask first, like registration. And he's asking me for my license. And I'm saying, you know, I, and I told him my, my broken Japanese that I don't understand what you're saying. I'm not Japanese. And he got pissed at me. And, you know, it got really bad, that situation. You know, he actually had to apologize later because I was a foreigner. I really didn't understand what he was saying. Yeah, so, you know, a lot of prejudice in Japan to foreigners. And lo and behold, I was considered a foreigner when I got here.